Hello planner people, welcome back to my channel. This is Raven from Plan With Raven and we are here with another weekly plan with me. So right now I just wanna show you guys how it looks so far in my planner. I've been loving it, I've been sticking with the habit tracker and with my mood tracker, so it's been going great. And when I planned this plan with me, it was February 4th, but now it is this Monday the 7th. So I'm just doing a little voiceover and stuff for you guys. I'm showing you guys what I'm gonna be using for the Be Happy Box. Um, um, sticker book I'm just gonna be using I think one of the black to-do list stickers and showing you the wash I'll be using for this plan with me as well as these two dark colored Crayola super tips and then of course my big little box of my big little box <laughs> my little box of my stickers I have a ton of them so the first thing we're gonna do of course is the coloring so I'm gonna super speed it up just to have it go by quicker <laughs> but yeah so I really love the dark colors for this one I wanted it to be more of a darker green because last week was a very bright kind of bold green color this one is definitely more of a sagey kind of dark green thing but it came out so well and I'm so lucky that I have these simply gilded washi that match the colors um very well in my opinion I really really love them so for this plan with me, I don't have a whole long, a whole lot going on for this week. I just basically put down the things that I know that are gonna happen, and you know, of course, things pop up, things change. So it's a bit of a smaller plan with me video, which is kind of nice. You could just kind of squeeze this in um, throughout your day. But I'm just coloring along, and I think my hand is getting some major like hand strength <laughs> because again, towards the end of this, my hand was aching of coloring. But, you know, it wasn't as bad as last time where I feel like my hand was about to cramp up. But yeah, so now I'm using the other more kind of, I call this like a sage green. What do you think? Would you call this a sagey green? I'm not sure. I don't even think the color box or the box where I have all these markers doesn't even have the colors labeled. So I'm just making up my own names. So this is my sage green marker that I'm using. <laughs> um... But it's going really well. This week has been really well. Uh, last week ended off great. I was so productive. I was very proud of myself. I got a lot of things on my to-do list done. I want to know how have you guys been? Definitely leave a comment down below and let me know of something you know that you accomplished this past like month or so. That's awesome. So proud of you. But okay, so now I finally finished the coloring and I go to kind of color in my date dots. So I highlight my this week box again and I'm just doing alternating coloring of the date boxes. So for this week is from February, not February, March 7th to the, is it the 12th, the 13th? The 13th, I just checked my planner. <laughs> so after I write that in, or I don't think I write it in yet with my pen, but I decide to lay down some washi. So here I'm using the thicker, dark green simply gilded washi again using my torrid gift card and i just cut up some pieces there having some trouble because this washi is very very sticky i think with washies that like you've had for a while i think the stickiness either like gets really goopy or it like the stickiness just goes completely away and so I haven't used any washi in so long so a lot of my washes are a mix these aren't very goopy but like they stuck very well the simply gilded ones this washi here this black skinny one I'm using I do not remember the name of the shop I purchased from but it is not a simply gilded one it's a different one but this one has had some trouble sticking down like even this week I'm constantly going back and pressing down the washi <laughs> because the corners will keep coming up but I will try to find out which place I purchased that washi from and I'll go ahead and link it for you guys. I'm pretty sure it is a shop that I found on Etsy. So hopefully it's still in my history. So I'll link that for you guys. And now I'm putting some washi towards the bottom of Thursday and Friday. I really wanted to use this kind of like grayish taupe colored simply gilded washi. Um, just because I think I purchased it and it came like in a set and I never used, I never touched it ever, but I really wanted to use it because I feel like it kind of goes with the theme this week and I'm having some major trouble <laughs> cutting this little piece of washi. So I end up pulling out my scissors and using a sharp edge to cut up the washi. So here you see, I got tired. I'm like 
we have technology and so <laughs> i use that there and then underneath the this week and monday box i use the skinnier um olive green or dark green washi as well with some of the um a skinny black washi i just think it looks really cute add some space there or it takes up some space there i'm just showing you guys a little gold foil wiggle so you guys can see that and then we go ahead and we start with this week so here is where i lay down the black to-do list um yeah i just keep this really simple for that section and i just write in this week and i actually pair it with this really cute sticker that i have um i think the sticker is from a shop called sprinkled pug but it's a sailor moon character and i used it because the color is green and it matches the um the layout i think it looks so cute i love it and then we get started on monday so i, I want to start doing is like a couple days throughout the week i want to try to like use some of my little font slash wannabe calligraphy and so i write hello monday and i pair it with a coffee monsters co emote sticker or not is it a whole emote it's one of those little monsters but it's drinking some coffee looks so cute and i use my pen just to go and write over it and put in hello monday and then i use my little basic design there to just kind of divide the section i was gonna draw like little plants but maybe next time <laughs> so then we start with my to-do list for the day i just write in my bullet box and a green highlight so for the highlights for this week i alternate so i use the darker green and then the more sage green and so monday i start my first day of courses with my boot camp it's called she codes and it's a three-week boot camp so today is day one and i paired it with a peaceful mind design sticker i have a girl on her laptop there um i think peaceful mind design it's now called pmd stickers but i'll be sure to go ahead and tag them below or i don't think i could tag them but i'll try to link their shop down below and if you follow me on instagram at pine with raven all of the stickers that i use are tagged in my weekly um my weekly pictures so if you're ever curious about what a shop is if you go to there it'll definitely be there for you and then monday i want to start a new workout plan because i told you guys i'm obsessed with grow a joe she actually has like a monthly plan that she's been doing so i'm just gonna jump in and i wanted to weigh myself and measure and i paired that with a joy of planning sticker of a girl holding some weights i actually need to go and buy some um more heavier hand weights and a kettlebell because i don't have that so i should add that here actually i should write down right now my planner now that i thought about it um but we go ahead and move on to tuesday now for tuesday i just write that i want to upload a new video basically this video you guys are watching right now will be uploaded on tuesday and i pair that with a fluffy maru design sticker and i just put to update my link tree and then make a thumbnail because my last video i actually forgot my video was up all day and i realized oh my gosh i did not put a thumbnail up so i need to make sure i do that and then next i need to purchase some plane tickets i'm gonna visit my family um and friends back in my hometown in fresno in california so we have to purchase our tickets tuesday our my trip's not until april so i'm so excited and we're gonna look into car rentals we might rent a car i'm not sure we're still debating it but um i just want to write that down and then i leave a little blank space there on tuesday because i don't know what else is going to be happening for that day so i just have that there and for wednesday i want to write that i want to work out i do write gym workout but grow with joe's workouts are mostly like watching her videos at home so i don't think i'll be going to the gym wednesday maybe if i just feel like it but i don't know i just wrote that down there and i paired it with a sticker from rainbow bunny co and then after that i go ahead and write that we have to do some grocery shopping and i pair that with the sticker from kina prince and it's this really cute like grocery sticker it's very kawaii i definitely need to make more purchases because i've been getting back into this like cute kawaii type sticker designs <laughs> and then after that i want to write that we have to do laundry again and i wanted to do like a um swatch in the background so i'm making it a little bit bigger because i didn't realize how big this sticker is so it's kind of like that has like a green background and i think it looks really cute so i put that and the sticker says effing laundry and it's from honey the honeybee shop yeah 
So now we move on to Thursday. Thursday, all that I really know I have is a book club meeting. So I lay down another sticker from Tina Prince, and this is of a little girl who has like glasses and a book set up and stuff. So I wanted to put that down. And our meeting this week is going to be in the late evening time. So again, I'm writing a book club in my wannabe calligraphy writing and I put at nine o'clock because the person that hosts the book club, they live on the west coast and I'm on the east coast. So in their time, it's six o'clock. My time, it's nine o'clock. So it's going to be a little bit late, but I figure it'd be a nice thing to do, like kind of winding down before bed. So I definitely want to make sure I meet up for this week. And the book we are reading is called They Both Die at the End, and it's by Adam Silvera. We are discussing, I think it's like half of part two of the book, and it's very interesting. I'm definitely really interested in it now, so I'm excited for our meeting. And then for Thursday, I'm just leaving a little blank spot because I really don't know what else is coming up on Thursday for me. And for Friday, I go ahead and mark down that there is going to be this pre-order event. Um... There is this person on Twitter that is releasing these cute little like cow plant figurines. So if you know The Sims 4, um, a cow plant is a item or a creature that is in the game, but it's really, really cute. And I wanted to purchase one. So I wrote that the cow plant is on pre-order and I used a Tofu the Panda sticker from Stick With Me Shop to mark that I need to place an order. And I have to check Twitter because I forgot the website name. And I don't think it's even going to be on the person's like official website. I think it's going to be linked to like a specific pre-order page. So I want to mark that. And then afterwards, I left the little spot um, underneath it to add anything. Because again, Friday, I'm not sure what's going on. But I know Friday evening time, my kiddos are going to be back in town. By kiddos, I mean my stepkids. So I just laid down a family time sticker there. The family time sticker is from Let's Plan It. And then I move over to Sunday. I don't know why I skipped Saturday, but I move on to Sunday. Um, Sunday, I do know that my homework is due, so I wanted to mark that. Um, I'm using this really cute like flat lay sticker, and it's from an old sticker shop that goes by a little bow prints. So I'm just laying that down, and I made a little mistake there <laughs> when I tried to do script or cursive hw for homework i added an extra like w <laughs> so i go and use some white out and i kind of fix it make my little design there and then i just put a little reminder that everything is due by midnight so i have to do that and so there i am just putting my little box my little highlight and then i believe i go ahead and i write over the script writing that i did so after that, I think I moved to the top of a Sunday because I just wanted to, wanted to mark that in case if, you know, time gets away from me. But every Sunday I have a call with one of my best friends, Sarah. And so I have this super cute sticker of two girlies from Kina Prince. Um, so that's Sarah on the left and me on the right. And then I'm just writing a call with Sarah. I just like to check in with her, see how she's doing. So proud of her. She just got a new job recently. So I have to hear about that this Sunday then I go over to Saturday and I use a such a cute like I don't know if this is kind of like a flat lay sticker I guess it is um it is from the Fox and Pip and I just want to mark that I want to plan for the week usually Fridays or Saturdays I try to get my planning in this week I'm gonna try to do it Saturday just because I know Fridays when my kids come in town it does get a little hectic for us so I do want to mark that so I just put that I want to plan for the week and import any files or do any editing kind of stuff so I'm just marking that there also again writing to remind myself to take those thumbnail pictures that I didn't last time and then I'm just leaving a little spot there and then I move over back to Friday because I forgot that Friday also I need to work out and to follow the plan I think Friday I'm gonna try to go to the gym again and I just pair that with a fox and cactus girl sticker getting her squats in so this is the finished layout I hope you guys enjoyed it it looks so so cute I love the foil of all the washi and if you enjoyed this please go ahead and give it a like and leave a comment down below of one thing that you accomplished so far this year I love to hear it 
And if you would like to, please go ahead and follow me on Instagram at Plan with Raven. There I post kind of like my end of the week spreads and midweek spreads and stuff like that. So it'd be great to see you all there as well. And if you're new here, please go ahead and subscribe because you never know you may be back. Thank you again, guys. Bye.